It do hit a little different. Hermes Link. Ice Blue Mix. Shout on my ribs like I do not know what permanent is. What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today is another mukbang. I don't know why y'all enjoy these so much, but we're doing another mukbang. Um, and as you could probably see in the background, we are at McDonald's today. Everybody's favorite. No, I'm just kidding. Everybody on McDonald's. But you know what? They're spicy nuggets. They smack, okay? So that's what I'm here to get. And since it's a mukbang, I'm also getting a bunch of other stuff, but I don't know what I'm getting yet, so I'm kind of stressed and I'm up next. I hope you're not the best you can help me. Um, hi, can I get a 10 piece spicy nugget with- We don't have those, we don't have those right now. The spicy nuggets? Yeah, we're already sold out. Oh, okay. Then can I just get a 10 piece regular nugget? What sauce? Uh, no sauce. And then a medium fry, um, a Sprite, and can I get an apple pie? Anything else? That's all. That'll be nine, but yeah, thank you. Thank you. Why am I here then? I'm so upset right now. I'm so upset right now. How are you already sold out of spicy nuggets at 12.36 in the afternoon? That is a lie. That is a lie. What do you mean you don't have those? What do you mean you don't have those? What do you mean you don't have those? I'm so upset. Cause they're so freaking good. Like they're so good. Now I have to have some regular ass nuggets. I purposefully ran an extra mile so I would be able to get myself some spicy nuggets. And now I'm not even gonna, whatever, whatever. And I never get Sprite. And I got it for the video because The fries look soggy already, so I'm about to cry. <laughs> Let's try a fry and see. Okay, not bad. <laughs> I take it back. <laughs> I love McDonald's fries. Mc huh? McDonald's fries are elite. I don't care what anybody has to say. Nobody gets the salt right like McDonald's. It just is what it is. And it ain't what it ain't. Let's try to spray and see if the one in the mountains is like battery acid. It do hit a little different. It hit a little different. Look how plain they are. Look how freaking plain they are. Okay. Okay. But my thing is, these ones are hot and crunchy. Imagine how good the spicy ones would have been. I need to start carrying spices in my car so I can just, if something bland, I can just, they are good today, I can't even front. I still just don't understand how you're sold out of spicy nuggets by 12, 12.45, but 12. Who was ordering them at 10 a.m.? Why are they sold out? Because I've definitely gotten them at like, 11 o'clock at night and y'all weren't sold out at 11 o'clock at night but you're sold out make it make sense make it freaking make sense if they meant they're sold out permanently <laughs> i will cry i will cry let's get to chit chatting so what's going on in my life should i put my fries in here oh look at that Munch munch. Have y'all seen that guy? Every time I like try to be funny, I go like this. Because there's this guy on TikTok and he is hilarious. Hilarious quality content. And he likes talking like this. And it's hilarious. Hilarious. If you, I'm gonna insert a clip so you know what I'm talking about so I don't look crazy. I'm tiny, soft as a mystic way. He gently touching my soul <laughs> Because the fire that burn in me <laughs> And I simply lose control So just
Hello? I'm about to lock my door. I think the first topic of discussion, since I just mentioned TikTok, and um, the day that I'm filming this, apparently, allegedly, TikTok will be banned on Sunday. The day I'm filming this, was today? Today's Friday? Yeah. And TikTok will be banned on Sunday. Apparently, it's like where you can still use it and watch stuff, but like you can't, if you don't have it downloaded now, it won't be in the app store anymore and like there's no there's not gonna be any updates um, i'm not thinking why i was just getting into it i was just starting to watch tiktok every night before i went to bed <laughs> and i'm upset it's upsetting me and my homegirls because if we can't have vine and now we can't have tiktok what the hell can we have like damn i just want to laugh is that too much to ask for twump is that too much to ask for twump but i saw abc post it like on their instagram and people in the comments tell me weak like y'all are so ignorant y'all are just so ignorant because people are on there talking about some some people were like oh my kids are gonna be upset like or you're pissing a bunch of like you're pissing a bunch of people off who like just turned 18 who can now vote and who are gonna vote emotionally off of the fact that you took away TikTok and they're gonna vote against you. But like some people were in there talking about, oh, it's better for the kids, you know, the kids are gonna grow up to be whores because they're listening to such music. I'm like, no, that's your fault for not parenting your kid properly. I don't know why your six year old child is on TikTok period. That has nothing to do with me. That has nothing to do with TikTok. That has to do with you and your bad parenting, Jimmy. Take the phone away. Why is it six year old? Huh? 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 I just, like, why does a six year old have a phone to begin with? I'm not understanding. Like, maybe if y'all paid attention to what your kids were doing and restricted them from doing certain things maybe it would be better but like people are mad at freaking cardi b and megan the stallion for making wop because they were like oh you're corrupting my children why is your child listening to it why why are you allowing your child to listen to it you let your kid boss you around <laughs> you let your kid tell you what your kid is finna watch no dumb okay okay i forgot it was sprite for a second because <clears throat> i usually get sweet tea <sighs> that was not sweet tea did y'all see the video of them cleaning um on tiktok i've been learning stuff on tiktok tiktok is educational twomp um but they cleaned like i don't know what you call it the grill the thing that you like make the burgers on at the fast food restaurant they cleaned it with sprite freaking sprite i keep looking up here because it's a spider i washed my window because i wanted it to die but it's just kind of sitting there i'm kind of scared but they like poured they literally just poured sprite on the grill and like wiped it off and it was i'm like what is in sprite what is in sprite what else should i talk about oh hmm. i um i mentioned it before in something i think it was a chit chat get ready with me i think i don't know don't quote me on it but i talked about my bartending class and how basically our assignments are to make a drink and present it on camera like to the class and i decided to get my drink recipes from tiktok and there's so many and they're so cute and we had our first um i didn't present but like the first person presented the other day and it's really fun like to learn about drinks that you didn't know before because I'm the type of person who, like, I've never 
I mean, I just turned 21 <laughs> in February. So I haven't really been like out and about, you know, getting real drinks. I'm more of a shot kind of gal. You know, take a few shots and drink a little juice, something like that. So, you know, like the real drinks that take ingredients and a glass, like, I don't know much about those. So, it's nice, you know, seeing different recipes in this one. The one yesterday was our professor, um, like, showed us an example. And it was a beer Rita. And it was tequila, a beer, and lime, like, concentrate you know the like the frozen containers that you can like like they have them with lemonade and like you can make lemonade you know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about um and you basically just put it together and he said you can't take huh spit in spit in my food I'm disgusted I am he said you couldn't taste the tequila and you couldn't taste the beer which was good because I don't like beer but it looked Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know what this is doing to me. But I'm never getting a McDonald's right again. I just hiccuped and burped at the same time. <sighs> and my chest feels like it's been opened like to a different dimension. But I don't like beer. So when he said that I was like, hmm, maybe I'll try it. It's just so amusing sitting here and watching the kind of people that I live around sad actually I you know you usually just look at somebody and you just tell they're racist I was like everybody here I saw somebody who had the confederate flag tattooed on them you know what type of racist you have to be to get the confederate flag permanently inked onto your body like no change in your mind no growing as a person i mean i don't know how far you can grow as a person if you are still waving the confederate flag but no no potential for growth no nothing like that is your identity like People get tattooed on them that mean something to them. The Confederate flag means that much to you. That's a that's between you and God or whoever you believe in. Cause let me get into this apple pie. They used to be so good. My grandfather used to go. He used to go to McDonald's with some of his friends every day, once a week. Can't remember. I think it was every day, but I he brought me an apple pie like once a week or so. Or a couple times a week. I was obsessed, y'all. I was obsessed. But then they changed them. My like, what the f is this? It's so, it's so good. Not the best. But. The crust is better now. The crust is hitting. But. The apples, I don't know what's wrong with them. But some of them just like they're like little rocks in your mouth. I'm like, what is this? I don't know what else to talk about. I mean, there's currently nothing going on in my life. So I'm not doing anything but going to class online in my room. All I know is I've said it a billion times. I'm gonna say it again. The spicy nugget smack. So, if you haven't tried them, go try them because they're limited edition. Which, the spicy stuff is always limited edition. When Wendy's first brought the spicy nuggets, they're limited edition. Then Burger King did them, limited edition. The spicy strips from Chick fil A are limited edition. Why is the spicy stuff always limited edition? That sounds a little racist to me. I don't know how it's racist, but it sounds a little racist to me. Like, nobody wants bland nuggets. Give us some options. Give the girls some options. Now that the Sprite 
has burned a hole in my esophagus. I think it's time to end this mukbang because I have no more food to eat. My stomach is full. I kind of have the itis and I kind of want to take a nap. But yeah, that is the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this mukbang, even though it didn't go as planned. But you know, it is what it is. We roll the punches. But if you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Also, follow me on my social medias. I post on my story every day over there so you'll see more of me on my Instagram and stuff. But other than that, that is the end of today's video. And I hope you have a great day. Bye.